Here is a quick recap of on-screen remote control keys in STB emulator new version. Hold down OK enter button. See this, this comes up with the basic buttons. Go on top. This is the application settings, main settings. This is your current profile. Key maps, ignore it. This is to close the application or exit. Now to on the right, on the right we have, these are the profiles. Whatever profile you have created, it will show up here. And you can choose the one. If you want to reload also, this is the place. This is the player selection. For Fire Stick, only EXO works, other things. And also you can have external if you want. VLC is the best. <coughs> this is uh, audio tracks, not for this. Subtitles, not here. They don't work in Fire Stick. This is aspect ratio. You can leave it in auto or you can play around with whatever is available. Now let's go to left. Left is keyboard. These number keys won't work. This will bring up the keyboard from Fire Stick. You can use it for search or whatever you want to do with the keyboard. Yeah, then again, hit return to go back to this one. And these are useful things, red, green, yellow, blue for navigating through channels, setting favorites, etc. We have seen it before. You can check my detailed video for these features and then at the bottom we have rewind, play, fast forward which will work for video club for movies. This will switch to TV from video club directly if you want to switch. Blue is for search in video club. Check my short video on how to use search function using blue key. The remote keys disappear quickly by design. Need to get used to it. This comes in handy considering the fact that most smart TVs and streaming devices come with lean remotes with just a few keys for basic functions. Thanks for watching. Do post your comments and questions. Thank you.